shooting victim will go before Nebraska's parole board this week, questioning whether the man who shot him should be freed. In a story you will only see on six, he tells our Brian Mastery why he feels the inmate will terrorize again. So this is it. That's it. Yeah. Do you ever think that you'd get rid of it? <laughs> no. No, I don't go to the family. Inside his north central Nebraska home, Rick Morrow still has the rifle that saved his family 27 years ago. Back then, paramedics and police came to his home here in North Omaha. He had been shot three times by an unknown intruder who assaulted his wife and threatened to rape and kill their two young daughters downstairs. The only thing that stopped the plan, the loaded rifle stuck in the corner. But could Rick Morrow get to it in time? He did. We just hung there, him and me, both point guns at each other. And Rick Morrow finally took a shot, and his wife ran to the neighbors for help since the phone line had been cut. For the sexual assault and attempted robbery, 27-year-old Darwin Minton would be eligible for parole after 27 years. Nobody in the family ever stayed in that house again. On Thursday, Minton goes before the parole board at Omaha Community Corrections, and Rick Morrow will be there to share his story. Do you think he's going to do it again, though? Yeah, he said he would. The way the victim remembers, Minton told the judge that he could serve 27 years because when he got out, he'd still be young enough to do it again. With photographer Jim Hinchek, Brian Mastry, WWT6 News. If Minton isn't paroled this week, he will reach mandatory release in